hello guys welcome to the secure academy hope you guys are doing well so in this video we are going to discuss about how we can bypass sl pinning with the help of frida and objections so let's get into the video so before proceeding further we need some requirement so we need websuit frida tools objection and any emulator i'm showcased with nox player you can use any emulator like jenny motion android studio or etc for downloading notes player open your browser and type notes notes player and hit enter and you can see the option download windows 10 click on it and you can see the download option here window click on it it will automatically start downloading so wait for it so after downloading the Nox player, let's go and install it. Click on Nox setup. Click on yes. I'm not going to install because I've already installed in my system. So after installing, open it. take some time so now our notes bill is successfully open so before bypassing the SL pinning we need to configure our uh, notes player as a root so click on settings and then click on general and you can see the root option here check it by support it's unchecked click on check and save the setting it may ask for restart then click for restart so after that we need to install our frida tools and objection so let's get started now we need to install our frida tools and objections to so open parcel then after type click and it will download to me it will spend some time Let's open another power cell download objection. So type it is to objection and it uh, let's download Frida server 2. So open your browser and type server. Click on First, and we are bypassing so we need server for Android so you can see where is Frida server search it So we are going to download Frida server from here. So click on it. It will automatically start downloading. Frida tools and objections are successfully downloaded. Now open it, copy it, and paste it into the location of our Nox player. Here it Nox bin. Paste it. 
then uh, we need to push our uh, Freeda server into the our Android emulator. So for that, type cmd here. And first, we need to connect our Android device to the uh, to the command prompt. So we need to type adb dot exe. Uh, I'm typing here because there is ODB ADB file in our Nox. We will get in that. So let's check. Uh, yeah, there is very good. So uh, type ADB dot exe. So we need to connect ADVs exe so we need to connect into 7 0 4. first we need to check our adb device adb yeah here e here our android emulators fp and running on port number 62001 so we need to connect it first adb Connect. Okay, this one is and so it's already connected. So we have to push our Frida server into the device. So for that, like ADV dot push. What have we have to push is Frida server. Server. Data. Sorry. Data. Slash. Slash. Them. Click on it. And it will auto. Uh, it will. Uh, It will successfully push on our uh, Android device. So let's check out. So for that, click adb.exe and shell. Go to our Android shell. So for that, uh, we pushed at data local. So go to the this location. And control C. CP. So our Frida server is successfully pushed. So now uh, we need to run this server. So you can run with simply. So system bin Frida server permission. So first we need to give executable permission for our Frida server. So we need to type chain mode. Chain mode plus 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 x our Frida server click on enter then that is so okay it's saying that it's not executable Now we are going to push our Twitter server in the Android Android, so let's go. You can see our Android uh, server is successfully pushed now. Let's check. Let's give the executable permission <laughs> for beta server ch
then we are going to execute our beta server now trailer server is successfully run now <laughs> we are going to push our uh suit certificate on our load emulator so let's configure the proxy first open our suit option add, sorry add add new proxy like I'm going to shut on Iran.75 <laughs> okay T80 okay access then open your Android emulator go to your browser Six eight two two nine seventy five eighty and order CA certificate. You see, our certificate is more successfully. Let's sorry, uh, let's go and import this is an system certificate. So first uh, we need to change the extension of our certificate. So downloads page downloads change its rename it to ER to C R C let's install this is in our system. Install certificates. So click on install certificates. Click on download. Let me name your own and click on OK. We need to add a pin. Okay, thank you. Our certificate is installing. So that's fake. It may take some time. <coughs> so We have to configure our proxy first. Uh, and then go ahead, modify proxy and manual. Enter your proxy IP 192. Dot one six eight. Dot two nine. Dot seventy five. Then hit port eighty eighty. Okay. Look. Now our traffic is successfully intercepting. Now let's accept the any application like Facebook traffic on our. As you see that we can't 
able to capture the traffic of the that particular application. So we need uh, we need to <coughs> run our objection. So after that we can like intercept the request of our agent. So here we uh, here some steps to configure this. Now let's start intercept our applications request. So first we need to start the filter server. So I already uh, already connected with our device which you can see here I'm in the where uh, you can see so I'm starting the FIDA server Hit enter you can see our FIDA server is running properly now let's check the our package running on our Android emulator so for that Type following command. If in capital U, for oh, better this. Now I'm going to I'm going to intercept this particular application request. So here is the our, our application. For that, copy this. And then type here objection hyphen g your application package name then explore and hit enter. sorry it's my bad can see our app is open <clears throat> wait for a second Starting too slow. Now let's bypass the SSL pinning. So for that you have to navigate this command SSL pinning. Disable and hit. Now let's check the box suit and check if it is intercepting the requests or not. So click on here. I think it might be. So there you can see our host. So we are successfully able to bypass self pinning. So thank you so much. Like for. Uh,